Hey, it's Sue here from the Unicorn Advisory, your trusted Kajabi expert with another Kajabi quick tip for you. Now, I adore Kajabi, but there is a bit of a limitation of trying to quickly and easily see who currently is or isn't in the middle of a sales sequence or any type of sequence that you have set up. Now, you could have all the sequences and go and create filters and you pick every sequence that you've got in creation but the more sequences you have the harder it is to see who is in the middle of a sequence and who knows you might have set one up six months ago and someone's randomly landed in it and you don't know that they are in it but thankfully there is a really easy and quick way that you can fix that and that is by adding what I call an in sequence tag now how I do this is go into the first email that goes out I want to add an automation when email is sent then add a tag and then we want to add a tag that I have set up already called in sequence you can call this whatever you want it's just a way of indicating that anyone who has that tag is currently in the process of getting emails that are in a sequence then you come down to the last email in that sequence and you add another automation so this is when the last email in the sequence is sent then you remove the tag in sequence there we go so now when someone is in the process and getting all of these emails that tag is going to stay attached to them which is really really helpful because what we can do to ensure that they don't get any other emails maybe you don't want them to get your newsletters or perhaps you're promoting a webinar or um, anything else and you don't want to have two promotions landing in their inbox at once especially if one of them is an automated promotion and you don't have any idea when it started because they've um, you know landed in there well Thankfully, it's very easy. We just need to create a segment of people and we want to create that segment. We can either create it for anyone who is in a sequence or we can create it for anyone who is not in a sequence. So we're going to come into contacts, go into filters and we want the filter, um, the category to be tags and then we want it to say does not have in sequence and we're then going to apply that and then what you want to do is actually save that segment and we're going to call this not in sequence not in sequence and then when you are sending out any emails through your marketing area you can choose the audience and you can go into your segments and you can go and find Ah, where is it not in sequence and that is going to bring up everyone and send out to everyone who is not currently in sequence it's a really easy way to ensure that you are not double emailing and thankfully it's pretty easy to set up unless of course you've got to go and add it to a hundred different sequences but um, you know if you get in the habit of doing it and you go back and add it to the sequences you've already got set up soon it will be perfect and no emails are going to go out to anyone currently in the middle of a sequence now, if you would like more Kajabi help, please do subscribe to the channel or you can get on the Kajabi Quick Tips newsletter list. Just go to theunicornadvisory.com slash quick tips and you are going to get a daily dose of Kajabi inspo in your inbox. Hope to see you again soon. Sue from the Unicorn Advisory signing off.